Hey everyone, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today we are checking out the Devil Fruit mod, aka the One Piece mod. Now, if you guys don't currently know, I've said it a couple of times. I am currently watching One Piece. One Piece is my official first anime that I'm trying to watch fully through. Now, I have watched anime in the past, but I've never like gotten into it. You know how people have gotten into it. Like back in the day, you know, Toonami came on. I'd be watching like Trigun, Full Metal, Cowboy Bebop, whatever popped on Toonami. But I've never sat down and watched an anime. Like wanted to sit down and fully watch the one like I would like a regular TV show or something like avatar avatar is a recent show like two three years ago i sat through and watched avatar and Korra. but let's get to it before you ask i'm only on like episode i'm about to hit like episode 200 so there might be some knowledge i don't know but let's start with these devil fruits baby of course we got the goma goma no me we gotta eat it damn i ate two devil fruits okay i my bad i ate one off camera when i was testing there we go you've eaten the gum gum fruits your body's not made of rubber any attack on an empty hot bar slot will allow you to do a range punch but be careful of water of course we can't swim we had a devil fruit let's eat in action though so a punch on an empty hot bar is that what it said all right i have binded the abilities here that's not it oh <laughs> there we go look at that that's amazing of course we start with our first attack here the gomo gomo new pistol come on man who's trying to get pistol whipped i need to bring in some enemies let me turn this rain off though come on what are you trying to rain bro i'm allergic to that pretty much can't have no water near me all right let's bring in some zombies here let me hit them with that pistol okay let's not punch the floor let's hit them oh so it looks like it can actually like pierce did i just pierce a couple enemies right there yeah it looks like you can hit multiple at once so you do have to have an empty hotbar slot like you have to select an empty hotbar slot because if you see i put the zombie arm in there i can't attack anymore even when i'm pressing the ability key but yeah very cool it's got some range to it let me zoom out here let's see the maximum range let me try and hit something from maximum range like over here luffy can hit pretty far oh yes sir i love that range that's amazing i like the noises too all right let's press this key f what does f do that's where i put the other abilities oh there's also a misc power too but i think this is actually his rocket which is what he uses to grab things so this is his grappling hook that's pretty fire now we get the grappling hook let me go ahead and head over here though and jump in this water uh-oh i'm like a rock can i i can't even yeah i can't use any abilities it's just like the show get me the fuck out of here but i still can't move i still can't move help <laughs> all right there you go all right let's eat the next fruit here no idea what this fruit is god damn it i keep forgetting <laughs> i'm not blackbeard i can't eat multiple boom you've eaten the oh this is a template okay don't eat that one then well i gotta eat it again to kill myself all right actual next one the bomb bomb fruit making you a human bomb you can shoot bombs from your body to blow up enemies but be careful yeah of course the water thing let's see it this is mouse one. Oh yes very simple oh this actually breaks blocks too i don't remember the character's name that had this but he's the dude in baroque works mr five or something one of those numbers uh what's the secondary secondary so right click okay we got no secondary what about the alt ability okay it looks like so far we we have very just simple abilities they're not completely fleshed out which is understandable it would be pretty hard to flesh them out but let's see it in action let's see the damage it's looking good you know obviously we can take on a big group of enemies no problem you know who we can't take on probably Usopp. i don't think we'll be beating him moving on next fruit hold up i gotta i gotta re-eat a fruit kill myself just to get rid of it next on the list we got this one boom it is the human human fruit making you a human human i've always wanted to be one of those so what what is the special ability about this one can i like morph into people or something like i, I have no idea what the special abilities of the human human fruit are oh okay so this is the uh chopper fruit the fruit that chopper has but like i have no idea how i would use it what the hell would i do to use it i'm already a human do i do i hit transform i don't know <laughs> all right on to the next one no idea how i would actually use that one maybe i gotta play as like a reindeer class gotta install a reindeer mod next fruit let's see the love love fruit so this is the one that hancock has you've eaten the love love fruit so you can turn foes to stone with your beauty an attack on an empty hot bar slot will allow you to act cute and make foes fall in love another will fire a beam to petrify them Ooh. oh look at that i shoot a little like mist at them hey guy do you think i'm cute come on be honest how do i fire the beam do you hear that is that what turns them to stone let's see let's bring some zombies in uh, okay they love me 
and now there's stone okay so that one actually worked very surprising so i had to hit the the special ability one first to charm him and then the default left click that's how you make them fall in love or turn into stone very very nice i can't shoot any like cupid arrows or anything sadly to finish them off it's all good because honestly in the in the anime it's a pretty damn op ability all right last but not least we got this one right here let's check it out the wax wax fruit okay okay so this is the candle one. Oh, look at that little attack that comes out that's really all i see that happens i think that's the only ability we have get a little sword that comes out does damage pretty cool pretty cool obviously this mod work in progress going to be more developed adding you know more stuff for each devil fruit all the attacks and stuff and more or devil fruits in general but yeah last but not least if you're wondering how to get the devil fruits you gotta summon in a little town npc here the man the myth the legend dark king silvers Rayleigh. yes sir let's talk to our boy this boy he has all the stuff wait i can help you develop new power but you first need experience take down a large monster and come back hold up there's more to this mod than i thought let's kill a boss wait i probably should have did it with the, the gum gum fruit oh look level up do i get new attacks uh whoa what the hell was that was that his attack is my boy using conqueror's hockey bro yeah i i don't think i got an actual new attack here but he's got new attacks or i guess not really new attacks hey bro you're supposed to be strong as hell i know you're not dying to some slimes was this in the manga man <laughs> did i miss that let me switch back to the gum gum fruit just to see like you know maybe let me kill some uh, bosses like this. And then now let me talk to him. Let me upgrade. Can I upgrade him multiple times? Now let's see. Do I have more abilities with the gum gum fruit? I have no idea. Oh, look at that. We get a little charge up on the uh, rocket now. That might have a completely different name and I just don't know it. So is it like every time I kill a boss, I could get even more and more abilities? I have no idea. Oh terrifying tales about a monster in the underworld i got you my boy i got you let's uh go ahead let's kill the wall of flesh no problem wall of flesh dead using my master tome no me all right can i upgrade now yes sir level up your powers are improved and you have unlocked gum gum gatling yes sir you've also gained functionality in second hand use it wisely so we got that beautiful attack we got our regular attack can we use, we can use both at once and then now what i use this what, what, what do i press to do gatling oh, okay so gatling is just is just spammable so it's not like a it's not like a separate ability it's literally just spammable which is kind of how it works <laughs> all right what's next we got something else there exists three robotic beasts okay this is actually really cool how deep this gets into i'm not sure if it's like for every single fruit say like this one is more developed than the others obviously it makes more sense that this one's developed more than the others just given that you know Rayleigh trains luffy so let's see let's upgrade your punches will not do devastating damage so let's bring in uh let's bring in some zombies here and let's see how much damage okay so now i'm one tapping it. no problem any other upgrades that's all the upgrading you can do if you feel like your fruit powers still suck feel free to go complain to the developer she made a discord all right good to know that there's somewhere to go contact them but let's see our powers against the king slime we're using gatling and then we're gonna charge our shit up hit him in the face with that boom oh it attacks on the return too very nice i think gatling is the way to go man it does great damage it's easily spammable you love to see it but yeah i think we're gonna end the video here uh this is a sword right here you, you can get his sword it's currently unused but boom there's a, there's a sword all right since we know that the devil fruits are upgradable at least some of them are we're checking out hancock's devil fruit now and it says that the first upgrade we now have a pistol kiss or something like that the right click let's see this in action is it just a nice little damage dealer it is okay nice to see uh let's see the next upgrade past that boom now you're a whole snack enjoy that slave arrow i don't want to say the last part <laughs> slave arrow okay how are we using this i have no idea <laughs> oh wait there we go oh my god that looked amazing i gotta try that on king slime let's bring in king slime here and i'm hitting the third ability key oh my god and it freezes him turns him to stone that's pretty good can i turn him to stone i guess oh yeah i can cool it's pretty cool that you could like actually aim the arrow like i could shoot it upwards are those arrows gonna come back down i have no idea 
Oh, they did come back down. <laughs> All right, let's try and get a good shot here. Oh, yeah. That was pretty damn good. And then let's finish them off with these. Come on. There we go. And then I guess, you know, blast any remaining survivors. Pretty cool. That might be my favorite ability in this mod so far. Do we have anything else or is that it? Uh, you got that dump truck. You can bounce a quarter off of them thick cheeks. See, I don't think Rayleigh would ever say that. <laughs> I have no idea what that upgrade does. Maybe my character does just get thicker. It's all good. It's all good. All right, let's move on to the next devil fruit here. I believe this one is the other one I would expect to have abilities. So let us see. Oh, yeah, this one too, obviously, the bomb bomb fruit. Uh, let's upgrade boom. Uh, if you're having a hard time, you know what? Let's just max ourselves out and see how it is. So left click is still the sword. Is that it? <laughs> is the sword it we can spam the sword which is honestly kind of cool i guess is it i'm clicking other buttons and nothing's happening so maybe this one isn't fully implemented understandable i know that in the files there's a couple other weapons though maybe i'll throw them up on the screen here so i know that this one is a work in progress all right on to the bomb bomb fruit that's the wrong one i ate the wrong one this one let's upgrade we got the left click that blows stuff up let's see how it is if we upgrade it watch where you're aiming that thing you have unlocked a breeze breath bomb. Ooh. Does this explode the floor? No? Okay. Let's just see it in action against some enemies then. Boom. Okay. It's a nice little AOE ability. Way stronger than the left click, I believe, too. All right. What's next? Staying away from you, you have unlocked full body explosion. Oh, my God. That's amazing. I like that one. Uh, I'm going to just go ahead and get the next upgrade before we test that one out. What do you got? Your explosions are even more deadly, and then that's it. Okay, got it. King Slime, come on out here, baby. Come on out here and face my full body explosion. How often can I use it? Pretty often, as long as items aren't getting into my inventory. Uh-oh, I'm in the water. <laughs> I forgot my weakness as a Devil Fruit user. Wait. Oh my god, my items keep on like getting my hotbar keeps getting filled. It's fucking me over. And then we shoot him with some uh, regular hits. Go ahead. Hit him with a regular hit. Hit him with a breath bomb. Oh, we were comboing the king slime right there. Okay, I believe after that, that is all. There might be a couple little features here and there that I miss. That's for y'all to go explore the mod and check out. Cool little mod though. I really do like the abilities and stuff in it. Very nice that there is multiple abilities. And, uh, you know, obviously we got the grapple hook ability too. Very, very nice. And I honestly just can't wait to keep up with this mod and see what other additions it adds, especially as I go through the show. So make sure to show the mod developer some love and the mod some love too by downloading it. Because then we'll get more and more stuff added to it. But yeah, go ahead, install the mod, play around with it yourself. Find some things that I didn't find. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see y'all next time.